what, what now? Do I just stay still? Just don't move, I guess. <laughs> Baby laughed again. <laughs> hey everyone, and welcome back to the Silent Hill playable teaser. Alright, so, we're still in this corridor where we can move around really fast, where it's all flashing red. The endless corridor with all the eyes on the walls. So, I've got an idea, right? I've been thinking about it. I don't, I haven't actually looked anything up and I don't actually know what to do but still right now. But these eyes are all looking in a different way. So this one's like looking down. Is that looking down? Hang on. It's looking up, maybe. So you feel like they might be able to be directing me. Okay, so these, don't, these don't even look like eyes anymore. Because I feel like I've got to look in a certain place. Why is that spin? That one's spinning around. They're spinning around. So because they're kind of like rotating clockwise, maybe it wants me to go this way. And then, um, let's just see what the ones down here look like. Okay, now these ones are kind of like swinging from the top to the bottom. Okay, this isn't actually making any sense now. I thought it might make sense, like, guide me to where I need to be. I feel as well, as well, you know that hole in the bathroom? I feel like I need to look through this, but from the other side. So, there is, like, two or three bathrooms, so maybe if I find a bathroom that has a wall on the side that the hole is on. But see, that, that side is it's blocked by another room that you can't access. So, let me just quickly try that. We'll try and we'll find the bathroom. Here we go, there's one here. So there's a hole here. I'm looking through it now, nothing's happening. But if I go on the other side, there's still no hole, okay. See that like that's like a squinting guy, like it could be telling you to peek. See that kind of like makes me think that I need to look. I'm just putting things in my own head here. I don't even know if this makes any sense to you guys. This is just how my brain works and that's trying to really figure out what to do. I was pressing X on the painting as well just then. I think the problem is here as well, like, today's games, they hold your hand quite a lot, and um, <laughs> this game is like kind of making you do all the work. You need to figure out what's going on, what's the story, what are the controls, what is everything, and when that's the case, and you've been playing games that hold your hand, to come to a game like this, you really are like struggling. Well, I am anyway. Ooh, ooh, there's a hole. Okay, so that painting's on the floor. Let's look through this hole. Oh shit! Yeah, that's right. Okay. Can I look? Can I move as well? So I've got to hold the right stick in and move it at the same time. I can't see anything. Fetus isn't there. Is she in the bath? Sounds like the, the bath is below me, I can't look any lower. No turning back now. You're kidding me. Okay, it's open. Uh, we've got to go in here. Hello? You got fired, so you drowned your sorrows in booze. She had to get a part time job working a grocery store cash register. Only reason she could earn a wage at all is the manager liked how she looked in a skirt. You remember, right? Exactly Baby's talking. ten months back. The fuck. That was the baby talking. I just realized like I'd near the end of it. I didn't realize <laughs> Okay. Now what? I'm back to walking again. I can no longer sprint like Usain Bolt. So something's probably going to happen now. Can we find a door to exit through? Nope. Nope. Let's check this bathroom. Empty. Nothing happening in there. Okay, this is new. This is new. How did they design this shit? It's crazy. Okay, so what have we got? The, the clock is no longer switched on. The picture's lost all its pieces. 
And the room is no longer red. Okay. Scary shit, scary shit. I'm not even looking to my sides. Okay. So we've reset again. It's now midnight. Need one more piece for the face. Where can we find that piece? Will anything have changed? Is anything changed? Sounds like there's... You can hear that the outside. Okay, I can hear them all. I can hear them calling to me from hell. Door is still locked. But we're not, oh, fuck was that? What was that? Why did that happen just then? <laughs> Let's get in the bathroom. The bathroom's going to close now, I feel. It's so dark in here. Okay. Is this being filmed? If I oh, God. There's water in the bath. It's very dark. I haven't got my flashlight any anymore. Okay, so... 204863. Two zero four eight six three. Two zero 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 four eight six three. Two zero four eight six three. There's a phone here with numbers on. Can we use the phone? Two zero four eight six three. Whoa, whoa. What the? F what the hell? What the hell? Hello? Watch out the gap in the door. It's a separate reality. The only me is me. Are you sure the only you is you? What? Whew, this is a long, long demo. We've got our flashlight again. That bag's still there. Oh, it's moving this time. I walked. What? What? I walked. The bag just spoke. Who's inside that bag? Can I grab it? That doesn't make any sense. What is that? Alright, so let's get back into the room. Right, the lights are back off again. What time is it now? It's back before midnight. I don't think we're at the start again, because we've got a flashlight and we didn't have a flashlight at the start. So there's that picture still there. Need to find the last piece. See, that's just changed now to midnight. So I'm going to go for the door. Oh, it's there, it's there, hello. What was she doing there? I just seen the outline of her. So if this clock now says one minute before again. Yeah, see. So you've got like a little timer here to do something. That's what I think that is happening right now. Maybe you got a time. Did something happen at midnight apart from that woman appearing in front of me? I don't think it did. Let's go towards the noise. She's in the bathroom. Alright, <laughs> uh, I'm completely and utterly out of ideas now. I've just literally no idea what to do. Can we use the phone? Because that number that he told you on the radio, I feel like you're meant to use that, that number. There's no one to use the phone, is there? No. 204863. I think that's what it is. <laughs> Maybe it's voice activated. You know, the play I think my headphones are plugged in. And my headset. Hang on a sec. Alright, everyone. Hey, welcome back. Um, 
as I plugged in my microphone in the last part, or maybe the same part if I've decided to edit to get edit it together, my microphone that I was recording my voice with right now stopped working. Um, which is strange, so I missed out all the recording that I carried on with. I didn't actually make any progress though, so it's not a problem. So, I quit the game at that point as well, and now I'm back into it. And I think we are now back at the same point, waiting for midnight to come again. And I googled on the internet how to do this, because I spent like an hour in total doing this, and um, the solution is actually with the microphone, as I thought it was. But before we do actually carry on, we need to get the last part of the picture. And also you get that apparently by pressing pause and then holding R3. There we go. See how messed up is that? <laughs> it's right there. <laughs> Alright everyone, I turned it off and I'm back to it again. I've just been speaking to a friend who's done this game now, he's finished it. And he said he did it by... Walking 10 paces, waiting for the baby to cry. And then you've got the, the whole point of this now is you've got to make the baby cry three times. And there's different methods of doing that. There is ways where you can talk to the lady, Lisa, and there's also. Hang on a sec. That picture's missing again. Need to get this back again. You wait like anywhere, so let's wait by the phone. And then when it goes midnight, we'll wait for the noises to stop and all that. And then we'll walk 10 paces and we'll count the steps with audio. And then see if the baby cries. Then we're on to a winner, hopefully. So I'm going to take 10 steps. I think that was 10. I kind of jerked a bit. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, it worked. I'm gonna wait for a little bit, then I walk another 10 steps. Your pad's meant to vibrate as well. So I'm gonna walk 10 steps now. Okay, there was no, there was no laugh there. Apparently as well, if you scream enough, like a pad... Uh, <laughs> Hideo Kojima just wants people to be scared, so once once people have met his satisfaction of fear by screaming down the microphone, apparently that makes the baby cry as well. <laughs> I don't know. There's so many methods on the internet, and I don't know which ones are right or which ones are just bollocks. It says on this guide I'm reading here that after the second laugh, don't move at all. And then the phone will ring and the baby will laugh or something like that. But we've only, we've only had the baby laugh once. I'm going to make a lot of noise in the microphone in a sec. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> that didn't work. <laughs> gonna walk at me now. Scare me. Hello. Ah! Go away. Please. Ah! <laughs> you bitch. Okay. Uh, that doesn't scare me as much anymore. I'm kind of used to it. Alright, so I'm going to try a different method this time. Apparently you stand by the clock. Yeah, you stand by the clock, wait for it to change, and then once the bell hits midnight, you will hear the ghostly wailing audio and breathing. Head to the old radio near the exit and inspect it with R3. Then immediately move over to the phone, inspect it with R3. The paper will laugh, and then you have to make noise in your microphone until you get two more laughs without moving. It's a bit too... Um, Fiddly, really, to make it kind of like fun. Okay, walk to the radio, then I'm going to inspect it with R3. It's even darker now because it's red. I'll turn around, go to the phone, inspect the phone. There we go. So now we'll play at the microphone. <laughs> so apparently now you have to zoom in to the microphone and then the telephone and make noise in the microphone. 
So when I'm talking now, I'm obviously making noise, and I'll continue to make noise now. Doopy doopy doo. Hello? Anyone there? Help me. Help me. Lisa's gonna kill me. Ah. Okay, that didn't work. I was staring at the phone for ages, like six minutes, <laughs> making noise. Don't, no, no more cries. So I'm gonna try it again. And when I first look at the phone and like bit first baby cries, I'm not gonna take my eyes off it. I'm gonna keep looking at it continually until I get three baby laughs. It might take me half an hour, take me an hour. I don't know. I'm gonna get this shit done. I just want to finish it. That's <laughs> have it under my belt as being one of the few people that actually is able to finish Silent Hill. The PT. This one doesn't actually make any sense of why this would work. That definitely makes a baby cry. Laugh. No problem. And now I just make noise in my microphone. Right, I'm gonna win. Oh fuck, the baby laughed again. Alright, don't move. Don't move, we need one more baby laugh. We need one more baby laugh. We can get this. The pad's vibrating. The pad's vibrating, guys. Oh shit! What, what now? Do I just stay still? Just don't move, I guess. <laughs> baby laughed again. How'd you answer the phone? You've been chosen. That's it. You've been chosen. What has that done? Has that opened the door? Which door opened then? The front door? Let's try the front door. Nope. Okay, do I go through this door? Let's go through this door. That's the only door that it would be, right? <gasps> it ended! It's the end! <gasps> what now? Dad was such a drag. You're no kidding, mate. Oh shit. Okay, I haven't actually seen this trailer. I know a lot of people probably did look it up before actually completing the demo, but I haven't seen this. I know Norman Reedus is in it, the guy who plays Daryl Dixon in The Walking Dead. I guess that's I guess that's him. Hideo Kojima! I guess that's who you play as then. So are you a detective or you are you're not the guy that killed his family, are you? Unless that thing I just did then was like completely separate and has nothing to do with this character. Silent Hill Oh Excited. 
I'm actually, I said at the start of this game, this playthrough of this demo, this PT, that I wouldn't be playing this because I'm too scared. But actually, I really want to play it now, just because, I don't know, it's it's such a, a, not an achievement in a way to complete it, but you feel good when you actually, you know, beat your fears of walking through a door that makes a load of noise and there's a ghost at the end of it. Alright, so that's the end of um, Piss Take, as I like to call it. PT, that's what it stands for for me. Piss Take. Because it just, it's just fucking ridiculous. Alright, it's probably going to send us back to the start now. So I am pretty excited about playing... Here we go, yeah, to start again. I am pretty excited about playing Silent Hills now. It's It sounds... It looks like it's going to be really scary and actually really good as well with the graphics. They're going to make it even more scarier just how real it's going to look. So um, I will be playing this on my channel when it does come out. Along with um, other horror games that are coming out eventually, like Alien Isolation, that looks like a, a pretty scary game. As well as um, the Evil Dead? No, what's it called? That other one, the, the last of the Evil Within. Evil Within, that's what it's called. Alright, so this door can fuck off. We're not going anywhere near that anymore. We're done with this shit. Thanks for watching, guys. If you enjoyed this video, please feel free to drop a like and also subscribe for more daily videos of the latest games. And I will be doing full walkthroughs of any game that comes out in the future that I want to play. And also probably play it on the hardest difficulty just to add that extra bit of fun. I call it fun. You might call it a piss, uh, piss take. <laughs> Why not? Alright, see you guys. Bye.